Good day, everybody. I'm here today to show you how to make a home remedy. These are kinds of things that you learn from your mom and your grandma or your mama and your nonna um, to make you feel better when you're getting a cold, um, beginning of the flu, or just, you know, feeling a little crummy. So one of the things you need to have is a juicer, some kind of a nice little handy dandy juicer. You don't need a big fancy juicer. This one is a Pampered Chef. I love it. You can get them at the grocery store. You can get from Pampered Chef. You can get wherever. Anyway, you need one orange, one lemon, and I've got a couple here, and some honey. So all we're going to do, this is my favorite famous concoction called Honey, Lemon, and Orange. Gee, how hard is that one? So we're going to juice one orange. Make sure you get the top. You know, everybody squeeze around the sides and then you get those other, use the palm of your hand, you get, get it down to every little drop. Okay. Now, if you have juice oranges, they're the best and they have seeds in them. So you really need this, but these are navel oranges. These are the only organic oranges I could get right now. So it's all pulp. So personally, when I just, when I know it's just pulp, unless it's a piece of the white pith here, I'm going to throw it back in there. But if it's the pulp, I keep it. If it's a lot of skin, I pull it out. But really, most of the time with these good navel oranges, I'll save the pulp because I like pulp. Some people like no pulp. That's up to you. But anyway, now lemons are going to have seeds in them, so I'll leave the pulp out most of the time. All right. So all you're going to do with this is... I always make sure I get all the juice out here. Okay. I pour this into my little sauce pot with that orange pulp that I love so much. Okay. And then I'm going to put in, of course, I would. The <laughs> date doesn't want to come right away for me. One nice big spoonful of honey. This is a nice tablespoon here. So what I'm going to do with this now is I'm going to put it on the stove. I'm going to heat it just till the honey melts, not till it's boiling, just warm because honey is a natural antibiotic, has a natural antibiotic properties to it. And um, if you heat it too much, you're going to kill some of the benefits off. So just warm it enough so that the honey melts into the honey, uh, the lemon and the orange. And that's it. So basically what you've got here is my honey, lemon, and orange. You've got orange and lemon. They've got vitamin C. That's, we all know that's good for you when you've got a cold. The citrus, if you're, I hate saying it, if you're phlegmy, if you've got some, you know, stuffy nose or sinus stuff, you know, the, the citrus acid helps break all that stuff up. The natural antibiotic properties of the honey helps, you know, beat a cold, as well as it coats your throat, and makes it feel a little better. So it's kind of a win-win. Now, if you're an adult and you're doing this at night before you go to bed, which is a great time to do it, that's when I recommend you get my secret ingredient, which I keep under the counter. Or I used to, there it is. <laughs> Sorry, I hid it from myself. Let's just call it a little whiskey. Um, if you put one shot of whiskey in this at night, just not even a whole shot, maybe about a half a shot, it really does. It helps you sleep. You got all the beneficial health properties of the citrus and the honey. You know, there's a little medicinal properties in the whiskey and um, it does help you make you feel better and you, you sleep well. So try it out with the kids. Just use the honey, lemon and orange. Um, and during the day, I just use this. But at night, before bed, if you're still really feeling crappy, forget the, you know, medicinals that you buy at the pharmacy that are full of all kinds of chemicals. You know, they have alcohol in them too. Just use a little bit of, you know, your own pure stuff. And um, I really think you'll like it because it tastes good. It comes out to be about a half a cup. It's a small cup. It's like drink it like a tea and um, you'll really enjoy it. So hope you feel better if you're feeling crappy. And if not, I hope you get over it very quickly next time you're feeling a little sick. Ciao, ciao.